Alright, welcome back. We are still playing Resident Evil Zero. And we are going to go use the dial and open up a new area. And I, I'll just be honest, I haven't read any notes, but I do recall what the code is, so let's go ahead and do this. Alright, so... No, I didn't Google it. Yes, I did. Shut up. Now this is more like it. Billy here. Billy, I found an aerial cable car. We can get out of this place. Yeah. Wait there, I'm coming. Roger. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Out. <sighs> Wait there, I'm coming. There's, there's gonna be a little bit of difficulty with you getting to Rebecca. I'm just saying. But if I activate that thing over there, I can finally reunite with Billy, connect our two areas, and probably rearrange equipment and not have to worry about being all by my lonesome anymore. Well, I mean, until something else happens and I'm all by my lonesome again. But, uh, you don't know about that yet. <laughs> Devious. Still beat to shit. But it could be worse. I should go back and grab those shotgun shells real quick while I'm thinking about them. I would hate to leave them. And so far, I haven't used any first aid sprays. I'm starting to regret it because the game would be a billion times easier if I had first aid sprays to use. But I don't. I could use that. Oh, there's a there's a herb back there that I could probably have Billy use. Might help him out just a bit. Why don't I just have Billy come through? Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go, Billy. Let's see. Yeah. Let's go grab the hook shot. I'm not going back in that room with the hunters. I don't even care if I could stand in front of the door and actually open the door. That would be that would be lovely, Brett. Um, I don't even care. I don't want to mess with those hunters. I remember back when I was younger, I wanted to kill everything that uh, was in the game. I wanted to, you know, just, you know, take out all the monsters throughout the environments. And uh, these days, I don't, I don't do that. If I can leave something hanging out, I will. I keep thinking about that one room with the zombies and no items that I wasted bullets in. Those bullets will haunt me till the day I die. But, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's go back in here, have Billy use that herb, and, uh, continue on our merry way. There you go, buddy. Just tosses you up into the caution status. I'll go check over there. Yeah. Doop, 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 doop. Is that a bottle? Do I see a bottle? Wait a minute. I do see a bottle. 
And there's a gas tank that I was ignoring, but I'm not going to ignore now. Stairs. Let's see. I can leave these items up here because I am going to uh, grab the damn hook shot. I am going to be able to open the door and use them in just a bit. And I have bad news for everybody. Um, I'm going to have to transfer items again very, very soon. So that's going to suck. I'm going to have to bring all my stuff in here with me because uh, Billy did not come with me. But I will get him in just a minute. If I recall correctly. Fuck! Wrong button. If I recall correctly, this is the last place I need to use the hook shot. This is, uh, this is it. The final hook shot spot. some shotgun shells over there. Now that, that door is open, I'll open this and it'll all be connected. Let's go. Come here, Billy. Let's go on an adventure. There seems to be a body in the way. I guess I should uh get out the way first and then let you move and then go get the daggum shotgun shells. Oh wait, do I have shotgun shells on me? Yeah, I do. I'm pretty sure I left some, some... No, wait, I used those. Rebecca used those. So... Yeah. I'll go. Wrong okay. button. Follow me. Yeah. Okay. So, let's go back downstairs. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab stuff. Those items can just... Wait there, I don't want to trigger anything yet. I can't remember if it triggers. I've, I don't think it triggers until I try to get onto the rail car. Which I'm excited to get onto the rail car because I remember what weapon is on the rail car that I'd like to obtain. But we are going to check our inventory. What I'm going to do first. Just dump everything off except for the bullets because I'm pretty sure zombies have congregated in the uh, in the areas above I'll come back in a bit I know that the Molotovs are in that other little room crap I just realized there was a green herb and I could use that one lone red herb I had I'm not starting over. I could just start over the recording, go back to a save. I could always try and fight the um try to fight the hunter again too, but I don't want to do that. Yeah, I don't want to do that. But yeah, there are zombies up here again, but I just need to go back and get things like the G launcher and uh my health items. Um I I don't know how much I'm going to need those blue herbs, so I might as well bring them with me. But I never like combining blue herbs with any of my other stuff because poison is a very specific thing. And if you just get hit once and get poisoned, you could just use a blue herb instead of wasting all of your health. Watch me get eaten alive and I have to restart. Yep. I knew you guys were up here. I 
keep wondering if I should bring the gasoline with me. Where are my health items? Oh no, don't tell me I'm running low on health again. Because if that's the case, I am so going to die. I wonder if y'all are hearing echoes from other things in the house. I was, uh, <laughs> I was gonna wash some dishes and I left, uh, the other computer up in the front and angry video game nerd is playing. I, I am dangerously low on health items again. Damn, this sucks. And I don't know if I want to leave this blue herb here. Because if I, if I have to come all the way back here for it, oh well, I guess I'll just leave it there. What I'm saying is, like, when you're poisoned, you're not going to have time to run all the way back. You're dead. <laughs> but I should hopefully find more blue herbs up ahead. I don't, I don't think I'll need that. As long as I've got one for each of them, in case poison does happen, I'm alright. Also, I'm hearing another zombie, and I'm hoping I can make it back to the elevator before I have to fucking fight him. Yeah, he's back there. But yeah, I am low again on um, health. But the situation is, um, we're coming up on a, a moment where uh, Rebecca is going to be separated from Billy. I'm going to give Rebecca Billy's handgun so that she has a more powerful handgun to use. But um, I didn't know this was coming when I was younger and that I would have to play through certain sections just alone without Billy. And so Billy had like all of my best weapons and all of my like ammo. And Rebecca was just stuck. I could not, pers hell I could, I don't even think I survived the attack. I get, you, you'll get, you know, sneak attacked by a freaking <sighs> leech man. And um, Rebecca, let's split up. Roger. I did it again. Rebecca could not uh, fight the damn thing. It killed me every time. So, yeah. That sucked. I think I'll hold on to the shotgun for a bit. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to think of what I want to give uh, Billy. What, uh, what inventory I want to, to give him that I'm not going to be needing until I come across him again. Because Billy will keep all the stuff that's on him. You just won't be able to use any of it. I don't think I'm going to need to use the magnum besides I usually save the ammunition for that anyway so I'll just do that and uh, you'll wait right there while I go grab those small tops and uh, maybe that red herb but yeah playing this game Molotovs they're only in my opinion they're the only way to fight those leechmen the, the thing that you haven't seen is if you don't kill the leechmen with fire, like let's say you shoot them, if you shoot the leechmen, they're going to come apart and then part of them will explode doing heavy damage to you, your characters. And I don't, I just don't like dealing with them. They freak me out and they're hard to kill if you don't have um, Molotovs. Molotovs are the best way to deal with them. I keep wondering, somebody, my boy Kevin, gave me a, a DLC code and I still don't know how to access those costumes. I've, I've downloaded them, it's just, I have no idea. I have no clue in the entire world how to access those costumes. I don't think there's any poison enemies either between here and when I will come across Billy again. 
but he can't carry anymore. I am going to have him get rid of that. I'll give him the gas tank. Because he can hold on to that. The excess gasoline. I wish there was something else I could do with the gas tank, but there isn't. Oh crap, that's right. I'm going to have to... I gotta go up and use those items first. Um, you just stay there. I wonder if it would warp me. No, wait, yeah, that's right. It probably goes that I can't leave Rebecca. Wait a minute. Sorry, I'm just having like a million things go through my head and I don't want to leave these items up here actually because then I'll just have to come back up and get them. So let me go back down and leave them down there actually. I'm just trying to think because I have to have, I need to have those Molotovs on me. They can stay right there for the moment. But I'm uh, trying to think of where to leave stuff. I'm, 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 again, I'm doing that thing where I think about 14 steps ahead of where I need to be. And it confuses my brain because I'm a dummy dum dum. Alright. I'm gonna go uh, back up, grab the Molotovs, and I'm gonna have I'm gonna have enough space to pick up the items that I need to use, and then I'm going to come back down and Billy and I are gonna attempt to leave this place and something's gonna happen. Y'all don't know what's gonna happen, but I know what's gonna happen. And I, I don't know if anybody considers me talking about it, you know, spoilers or whatever, but it's like, you know, it's a freaking, what is it, 17-year-old game now? Like, you, you really should have played this by now. If you're just, you know, watching me play it, that's different. She looks like she's sneaking around when she doesn't have a weapon. I'm being stealthy. <laughs> but if I recall correctly I don't need the hook shot anymore unless there's maybe a secret that I haven't found in this new one Absolutely excellent. Wait a minute. I wonder. Okay, I'm moving the right stick. I can't control Billy. I can see him, but I can't control him because he's technically in another room. Billy? Let's go. Are you ready for shit to get real? Alright. This is gonna suck. This cutscene scared me when I was little too. Everything got dark, I'm alone. Maybe possibly unprepared for Maybe possibly unprepared for fighting a. Uh, Mr. Gangly Arms. And I'm beat to shit, so that's gonna suck. Doop, doop, doo, doop, doop, doop. I pressed the uh, wrong button again, but because Billy is gone for now, didn't do anything. Oh man. Stupid leech. 
bushes. Okay. I don't know why I did that twice. There we go. All right. Now, of course, a little bit more of item transferring. I, again, I know it's probably really boring. I apologize for it too, but when it comes down to it, there's just not really a whole fucking hell of a lot I can do about it. There's no item boxes. I just gotta put stuff on the little train, though. I think this is our ba our last big move until uh, the end of the game. I don't think this thing will move until I tell it to, so let me drop stuff and get a few more items. Dang, uh, I'm just all beat up. But, um, this guy right here has something I want if you guys can see that. That right there is the good old Magnum. I don't know what was up with the Magnum in Resident Evil 7, but it didn't look like I'm saying it doesn't look like a Magnum. It looks like something, but it didn't look or sound or even feel even remotely satisfying. Yes, I've used it. It's kind of a shit gun. Like, it's just not very good. <laughs> Alright. Let us get out of here. I'm just going to be beat up for a while. Yeah, I remember the first time playing this, though, the, the whole dichotomy of the game has been cooperation and having your buddy there. And at this moment, I was, I was worried. <gasps> oh, daggummit. You know, I really hate that I'm about to do this. But I am so desperate for health. And I left that red herb back at the other place. Oh, please forgive me, everyone. Oh man, I, I can't leave it, and I'm not gonna just use two greens, that's such a waste. There is a red, and I'm gonna go grab it. And I can tell how poorly some of this is aged, because that was all just pre-rendered stuff slowly moving. The doors look good, those are those are okay, but sometimes those cutscenes look like trash. It's kinda weird how she hops along when she's hurt. She doesn't move like I would think you would move when you're hurt. I remember one thing that sucked a lot was um, back in the old Resident Evil, I think 2 and 3 were the ones where, I can't remember if it still does it in the others, but in 2 or 3 when you got hurt enough, you got, you got slowed down. Like when you took, like when you were in critical damage, you could not run away effectively. And it's just like they handicap you so, so good in some of those older games. Alright, 
Sorry about that little detour, guys. But you know you want to see Rebecca back up to full health. Not all beat to shit like she is. If I could, if I could run properly. I'm probably just going to leave that magnum sitting there for now at least. If I grab it, it'll just be another thing I have to drag around with me. So holding on to Billy's pistol, it's like if you if you didn't already know that he was coming back, it'd be a memento just to remember him by. <laughs> All right, thank God. Health, health. I want some health. All right, much much better. Just gonna leave that stuff sitting there for the moment. this. I can't remember if this is the way I'm supposed to go or if the other one is. I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. Yeah, it opened. It's the way I'm supposed to go. I think. Tightly sealed. I can't explore Resident Evil 2 areas. Bullets are good. Bullets are always a nice thing to have. There's some grenade rounds that I should probably take with me. Do I need to... I don't know. I want the map, woman. Thank you. Oh, I remember, I remember where I'm going. I'm going back to grab a shotgun real quick. Because I remember when I was little, there was a moment that scared the crap out of me. Very, very sneaky, very devious little hunter. Also, this is similar, but I don't know if it's just, uh, oh, fight that yawn. I don't know if it's just the same area as Resident Evil 2 or if it's just a similarly, similarly constructed area to Resident Evil 2, but this place is like that last area in RE2. But I don't know if it's the same place or if it's just similar. I kind of wanted the shotgun. Just leave the G-Browns in here because... Billy has the G launcher anyways, and I won't be able to use it, so. Got a shotgun and two reloads. That's another thing, like, why is it there, I've, I've seen it in Prey recently, why are there so many shotguns with such low chamber counts? It's very annoying. Yeah, it's locked. That's later. I think there's some health in that area. Alright. Just want to make sure I was prepared for a particular, a particularly mean critter. Oh, that atmosphere. When there's no music, you actually get atmosphere in this games. Alright. Do I have room for an extra item? I do not. I hate my lack of hindsight. Wonder, I don't know if he'll show up since I haven't grabbed the item. Hey, he shows up anyways! Oh, he's got a friend! God 
fucking shit. Get away! Damn it! Number one, actually scared the shit out of me. Uh, number two, did not remember he had a backup buddy. And number three, I hate hunters. Uh, I tensed up. Yeah, but when I was little, that scared me too. I didn't expect it. He's, he's just like, surprise, I'm here, hello. Yeah. And I'm hurt again, so using that health earlier did not help. There's another random green herb, but I think I will save it and wait to see if another red herb shows up. Well, now that the hunters are dead, let's go grab that key. That's what I need. I'm trying to remember where exactly I am heading to. Because I'm remembering a particular room, but I don't remember where it is. And I want to get there. But I can't remember. God, those hunters. Sure do know how to sneak up on you. So, like I was thinking, it could be a similarly built area, but I don't know. I really don't know. I was expecting G. Birkin to show up at some point. Alrighty. Let's see here. Okay, I know what I know what that direction is. I'm not going that way though. There's no need to search this place. That's basically them going, we don't want to render this. <sighs> should have arrived here before me. He's got such tiny you looking arms. That's unfortunate. Or huge forearms. We should arrive at an old mansion which Umbrella uses for research. Come on, let's go. Wait, I've got to find Billy. Billy Cohen? You mean you found that criminal? Yes, but we got separated and... No point worrying about him. He won't make it. Come on, let's go. Sir, please. I need to find him. Don't worry, I'll catch up with you. Rebecca, all right, just be careful. I never saw him again. Yep. Oh, crap. I think I'm coming up on an, yeah, there's no need to search this place. Could have just told us the thing was broken. God, I need to go back up and get some health because 
yeah, um, I'm coming up on another boss fight, and it refuses to move any further. Oh, no. Um, I best get good, because if I die, we're going back. A while back. <laughs> oh, God. I don't want to die. It's not working right now. Alright, so. This is going to suck. Wish me luck. a proto tyrant that I need to remember to run to the left of I'm going to die guys I got no confidence I'm rusty at this game also I wish you could dodge in gameplay I don't like this. Ow! Oh god! Oh god! I didn't realize his attacks would track like that, guys. All right, come on. Do your do your move that I know you're gonna do. Ah, oh, god damn it! Well, I'm dead. That's the end of this part. Sorry, guys. Because it just keeps me back out to the game, and I haven't saved in a while.